as my people say it, to use the poem dish or not to use the poem dish, that is the question. They say you can never change someone else's mind, but with new information, you can help them arrive at a new decision. And what I'm about to share with you may very well get you thinking about your green program and maybe just turn it upside down. Happy Labor Day, folks. My name is Yilash P, and this is Food Packaging TV, and it's about to go down. <laughs> As you know, I've always been pushing a sustainable and eco-friendly product line because it's the right thing to do and we all have a part to play in saving our planet and to make conscious decisions. And I kind of want to be there to help other people make that conscious decision. But what happens when you learn that eco-friendly products that you love so much and that you are offering your customers are in fact poisonous to their health and to the environment? What if I told you that they're so bad that I would actually rather offer foam products rather than pulp? The reality is, majority of the pulp in the market utilizes a special chemistry called PFAS, which stands for polyfluoroalkyl substances. Now, these chemicals are used to create the grease and water barrier so that the pulp products can maintain a longer shelf life with hot and greasy foods inside. But at what cost? What if I told you that PFAS has a direct link to kidney cancer and testicular cancer? What if I told you that PFAS is also known as a forever chemical because once they end up in the environment, they never go away. And this is why New York has banned PFAS in their food products because their water has been drastically contaminated with PFAS to the effect where they actually have deaths as a result of PFAS in the water. As much as I love to provide eco-friendly solutions in the form of pulp, I can no longer in good conscience offer these products to my clients knowing full well their detrimental effects. You know, I know I have product on the floor. Whatever I have has to go, but I don't think I'll be moving forward anymore. I can't believe I'm gonna say this, but the truth is, offering foam is a better option than offering pulp products right now. But don't fret, I'm not about to sell foam at our company, but I did want to share with you that there are other eco-friendly options that are 100% safe, compostable, so you can feel comfortable about your buying decisions and giving them to your clients. Last week, we did a spot on Earth Choices One Box, and I have samples of them this week, of course. And as I mentioned, the one box will be releasing in the coming weeks and they're going to be able to meet your hot, cold, and wet and dry food offerings with various sizes to choose from. They utilize a barrier film called Flex Shield, which is GMO free and PFAS free and 100% compostable. This is the same Flex Shield barrier that are used in the Seaside Paper products, West Rock products and EB Box. Seaside Paper has the most amazing offerings with respect to their takeout trays. They have an awesome side wall that is steeply angled. When you order your food, it keeps your food inside the box. They essentially, they use the same footprint as say for example, here's a number one, so you can see the folds. Here's their ones, boom. The same footprint as their full full boxes. Speaking of four full boxes, they're also available from West Rock and EB Box. And yes, they all use a flex shell technology. So no matter which brand is available at your distributor's warehouse, make sure you ask for one of these brands to get the most healthiest product. If you want to look at other products that is one step in the right direction, I would direct your attention to either GenPak or Earth Choice or PCM products that have the TFPP hinge lid containers that come in a variety of colors, shapes, and configurations. The reason why I put them in the one step philosophy, which is how can I move you one step in the right direction towards sustainability, is because these containers have a mineral filler in their production, allowing them to use less poly resin and at the same time achieving their product integrity, functionality, and reducing the reliance on fossil fuels. They're also 100% recyclable where available because there's a black obviously, but they do a phenomenal job with hot and cold and wet and dry food. So the next time you're thinking about opting for a compostable product, be sure to ask if the pulp products that you're gonna be using are PFAS free as there are new lines that are coming out with new chemistries that are entering the marketplace such as Eco Products Vanguard line and Sabre, which is also launching a new PFAS free line, which will be for another day, but if you don't have access to such products, please do find products that use a Flex Shield product technology or if you think about something that is one step in the right direction. Keep your customers eating safely, healthy, and guilt-free. And that's going to do it for today's episode of Food Packaging TV. Thank you for joining me. My name is Elash P. Please feel free to subscribe, like, share, and comment. I'd love to hear from you. Ciao!